they, they weren't going at each other at all. Here we go. This will be the real match. Charlos versus Ronnie. Okay, it must just be like a first name kind of tag. Um, so we can already write him off as being uncreative. Just kidding. Man, I'm, I'm throwing a lot of shade Ronnie's way. And he's yeah. doing okay right now. Uh, so the, the beginning... What's this? Oh. Sorry, go ahead. What's the story behind Charlos' tag? Um, his... I don't remember the whole thing, but his name is Richard, so the charred part comes from his first name. Yeah. And then Los... I don't remember. I'll have to ask him uh, after the set. But uh, it's like a combination Ooh, of a couple early kill of with an up smash. All right, so Richie takes the first stock, but he's at 104%. Uh, he didn't really give himself a lot of room to work with on this stock. And he gave himself a lot of room to work with him. That's another stock. That's the commentator's curse for you. Fox. Fox is just Fox, man. Fox. Randy uh, up smashed in the wrong direction at a shield. I guess maybe he thought he was going to be on top of him or something. Oh, maybe he didn't you missed it. Running. Oh, there's that uh, drill reset. That super hype move that you saw. Uh, lucky dude to West Ball's like a year and a half ago or something, and it's still really, really cool. I, I saw an interesting video today about how Fox's lasers are actually the second most positive move he has on shield. So, like, huh. um, after shine, the next best thing that you can do that gives you the most frame advantage on their shield is to laser them. That's and, and then when you land, like, you have all of these options that huh. uh, will all come out before they can shield grab. That's interesting. So, great great option for shield pressure. I don't know whether Richie has seen that video, but he seems like the type of player to have seen it. Doesn't also, also doesn't look like he really needs it right now. There goes Falco's loses, side B uh, Meteor. Yeah, even as he loses that stock. <laughs> Woo! Blinky, blinky. <laughs> Yeah, Richie looks like he's just kind of warming up. He's getting there. <laughs> Shares a little bit of a laugh with Ronnie. Um, so Fox, Falco... I feel like Dreamland is probably a good pick because it both nerfs Fox's upwards KO moves and Falco is better at using the top platform. Okay, They're going final destination. FD is... Uh, they, they both blow each other up here because uh, Fox is a chain throw and Falco has uh, wave shine combos. So it's basically Ronnie saying, I trust my punish game the best. I want to bring you somewhere where I can get uh, really quick stocks, really volatile stocks. Um, I think that's not a bad strategy, especially when Charlos has proven that he's probably the stronger 30 player. 30 seconds into the two. game, Ronnie just lost his first stock. Right? And that, I'd say that's about average for Spacey Ditto. Spacey Ditto's go real fast. Um, when, uh, when you are probably not the better of the two players, you generally want to take them to where um, there's the most volatility, to where um, the most mistakes can happen on your opponent's part, to where like you can get a, a quick lead, you can do burst damage, yeah. so to speak. And so that, I kind of respect this decision for that reason. That's uh, a is that a concur confirmed combo, uh, Fox, uh, Falco's shine into back air? Uh, yes, the Shine Back Air works on, like, every character in the game to a ridiculous, high, ridiculously high percent. Uh, there, there's actually an ongoing uh, run at a record for the highest percent you can land the combo at. What is it? Uh, currently, it's somewhere in the 580% range. Uh, wow. It's, it's done on a Peach for some reason. I don't know why exactly. Why Peach? Standard, she, has a very, she has a very slow fall rate. Um, it, it might be that... Um, Charge up the ups, but he really wanted know. the full I, I'd smash. I'd have to look into, like, statistics of the characters. It might have something to do with, like, her being the last character you're able to get the combo on or something like that. Hmm. Needless to say, uh, Shine Back Air, like, you throw out the Shine, that only takes one frame, and then you can jump cancel it on frame four. So there's no way that you are ever going to be so high of a percent that the Shine just sends you too high to get the back air if you're fast enough. Ooh. Yeah, Charlos looking like he's uh, gonna take this pretty cleanly. Uh, Ronnie has had his moments for sure. Like he's he's definitely got fundamentals in the game. He just doesn't have the same punish game, and he's getting caught out by some fox tricks. Well, you know what they oh, say about the fox. 
Charlos is cooking. Oh, oh, he really wanted that up smash. Yeah, I'm surprised that the down air actually connected. Like, he just hit a barely forward-facing hitbox. Uh, must have been a mistake from Charlos. I think he was trying to shine wave that. Oh! Planks what were you thinking? Attack. Well, he, he was going for the get-up attack. Um, but uh, Ronnie there... Um, his hitbox was either disjointed or it just beat Charlos's out. Um, I actually don't... It would probably beat it out percentage-wise. The uh, rule is, if it does 10 more damage than the other move, it'll just straight up beat it in a trade. Hmm. So, uh, oh, I did, I did not the get-up attack probably does less damage, especially than well, a charged forward smash. Well, they say about the...